Alrighty, hello everyone. I am Sushi Fish. We're doing a little, it's going to be a little bit different. So I have a massive backlog of games and such. I want to put out more content. One plus one equals two. So here we are. Um, this will be the first of hopefully many pre-recorded um, episodes, for lack of a better term. Um, that might not be the right term, but so it goes. Um, we'll go ahead and flip on over. Things are going to look a little bit different for uh, the streaming setups, just because... Um, it's, you know, my usual overlays, which I will show here just for, uh, I guess posterity, but I don't know that that's the right word either. Um, this is what everything normally looks like. Um, this was made by Naomi Shu. You can check her out on Twitter or on Twitch. <coughs> um, she's fantastic. She made... The background here, not the little emotes there. Those are made by um, Hawaii uh, Brittany. She's Brittany's also fantastic. Um, they're both wonderful, wonderful ladies. Um, both of them on Twitter. Uh, but because it's made for a live setting, I didn't want to use it for this pre-recorded stuff. Instead, we're doing this. I'm going to scoot down just a smidge. By just a smidge, I mean almost all the way. Um, but yeah, just a little bit a little bit cleaner. Um, a little bit more... You can see everything, I guess. Uh, you know. You know. You know. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> Did I break something? Uh-oh. <laughs> That's off to a good start. I, uh, I knocked my water bottle, like, flat onto the keyboard. I don't even know why I put it there. <laughs> oh my god. What is... What? What is a full-width character? I don't understand. That's very bizarre. What the fuck? And then it doesn't hard cap you? What? That doesn't make any sense. Uh, okay, we're gonna have uh, Rufus. Oh, uh, does my gamepad not work? Oh, it, it does. I don't know why. Okay, that's weird. Um, <clears throat> Balaam? Uh, Saren, which is a default name, and Boomer. Awesome. <laughs> is this the most optimal setup? No, not really. Far from it. But it's what I want to use because it's what I like using. The world lies shrouded in darkness. I'm not, not a professional voice actor. I just figured I'd put some pizzazz over the over the background. It's very ominous. It's a very ominous opening. The world's not having a good time. The winds die. It's terrible. Hmm. The seas rage. Why are they... Why is the ocean molding? It's probably not a good thing. The earth decays. This game is so fucking loud. <clears throat> but the people believe in a prophecy, patiently awaiting its fulfillment. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. 
After a long journey, four young travelers did at last appear. And in the hand of each was clutched a crystal. Which apparently just broke. So that's cool. Dropping my water bottle and legendary crystals. Okay, I don't need this. Um, God damn, it's so. F oh, it's so loud. Did it undo? It did. Okay, that's weird. Like, undid all my settings. That's really bizarre. Okay, now it's like too quiet in the menu. It's so fucking weird. I don't fancy. Why you like this? Okay. Unfortunately, um, I tried to do as much as I could with all the setups and things. Uh, how do I close this? <clears throat> um, before starting recording, but it was all a little... What the fuck? Why are these ones blue? Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Get out of the trees. Oh my god. Okay, these controls are going to take some getting used to. Because they're very bizarre. Oh my god. I'm sure he'll be fine. Let's go into town. <laughs> Let's go get questline stuff done. So, I haven't played this um, in... I have played 1 through 6. Uh, which we will be doing in order. Um with a small break after one to play Strangers of Paradise because apparently that's in kind of where that should fit is play one and then play Strangers of Paradise and then play whatever else you want. Um, you don't have to ever follow an order with uh, Final Fantasy. They're not sequential unless it's side games tied to a game like strangers of paradise is tied to one uh crisis core and dirge of cerberus are tied to seven um 15 has a lot of little stuff that's tied to it uh and you know so on there's 13 to 13 3 um 10 to things like that those are all tied into that game and those need to be played in sequence otherwise like one you can play one six three like whatever order it doesn't matter um, the only recurrence is that number one, something happens to the world where everything gets broke, probably by a bad guy trying to harness chaos or darkness or whatever term you want to call it. Um, chaos and darkness are the two main ones, I think. <coughs> oh, God. And then number two, crystals are involved i think later in the series it goes to six one for each of the six elements that they use i think at this time it was four which is weird it's weird to think about that this is cornelia the city of dreams that's a stupid what's popping who are these guys be most happy to teach you about equipment would you care to listen for sure Equipment can be split into two categories, weapons and armor. Equipping a weapon will increase your attack rating. Four types of armor, shields, helms, gloves, and body armor. I don't know why this is the voice I decided on. <coughs> Any armor you wear on your body, including armlets, is classified as body armor. Shields are held in one hand while helms are worn on the head. Remember that the weapons and armor you find won't do you any good unless you equip them from the mint. Yep. Selecting optimal will automatically equip the strongest weapons and armor in your inventory. Okay, I mean, we. the thing is, like... <coughs> oh, that map is cool. 
Uh, we know that is cute. That is, I like that. We know all this. The only big thing, um, is, yeah, we're going to go ahead and take that off because I think very soon, very shortly, the monk is able to multi-hit without a weapon. 30 gil per night. God damn. Oh, we got, <clears throat> we have that much. Fantastic. Oh, that's a lot faster than it used to be. Wow. Okay. I'm wondering what other quality of life things happened because it, cer it certainly wasn't graphics. Oh my God. This is basically the same graphics that were on the Game Boy Advance, uh, which is the version I played. I was not graced with the NES or SNES games. Uh, not going to talk to the guard. What up, girl? Hi there. I'm a dancer. What's that? You want to dance with me? <laughs> what, what if I do? Where are you going? Okay. Well, that conversation's over, I guess. I once lived far to the east of here in the harbor city of Provoca. Pro Provoca? Provoca? These days, I hear it's turned into a pirate's den. Sounds pretty cool. It's so hard to tell what the symbols are above the doors. Because back in the day, that was how you know what shop to go to like this has i guess it's like a teapot um up above the door which means it's like a general store please rescue lady sarah who the fuck? first off who are you secondly who is lady sarah they're not in need of my services do not lose heart brave warriors oh yeah so we can bring if anybody dies we can bring them in here we almost had to do that for boomer uh what other oh that's helpful yeah so the black i guess it's supposed to be an angel i've never really thought about what that is uh it looks like a winged person um that's for black magic the black one is the white one is for white magic obviously uh shield is for armor and shields and then the weapon is for weapons um the bed is for the inn which you've already seen in action uh, I guess the church isn't marked. That seems a little messed up. Um, and then the... I guess it is a teapot. Is for, like, general store goods. Um, for those that don't know. For those that have never run through all this, right? These classes definitely do matter. Um, if you ever play the classic Final Fantasies, which is 1 through 6. Um, don't worry about it. You know, unless you're, like, trying to min-max in 100% or anything like that, don't worry about this. You know, don't worry about what the comp is. Because it really... It doesn't matter. You'll you'll get through the game with anything. Um, warrior turns into Paladin. Uh, they can use a little bit of white magic. Um, I think it's, like, up to level 4. Uh, they can use white magic. Um, and they are very beefy. They're the beefiest in the game. Uh, far and away. That's what they're there for. They're your typical paladin. Uh, monk turns into, I think, black belt. Um, and they specialize completely in dealing out a lot of physical damage with their bare hands or with specific weapons. Um, like if you put a great sword in his hands, he's not really going to be good with it. But I think like staves. Um, in later games, there's more specific weapons, like punching weapons, things like that, whatever. Uh, what we don't have in the party is the thief, which turns into a ninja. They're very quick. They can do pretty okay damage, but they're pretty squishy. They're very fast. Um, and they do up to level four black magic when they're a ninja. Um, then we don't have a red mage, which is like the go-to. Uh, like the min max party is like, I think it's two warriors and two red mages or one warrior and three red mages, like just some combo of a red mage and a warrior. Um, red mages are a white and a black mage mixed together without being able to reach 
the final, I think they go up to seven, like seven or eight as a red wizard of white and black magic. Meaning they can, they're a jack of all trades, they can do all kinds of stuff. Um, in later games, they're so fucking rad. In like in Final Fantasy 14, the MMO, they are fucking awesome. That class is so cool. Um, and they do diversify a little bit to split from their white and black mage counterparts. Um, but that's always been the thing. They do a little bit of both. Um, they're also pretty decent at melee fighting, which is good. They're just a jack of all trades. Uh, white mage does white magic all the way up to level 10. White magic is anything supportive or anti-undead. Think like a cleric from D&D. Um, a lot of it's going to be healing or status uh, effects, whether it's putting a debuff on an enemy or taking a debuff off of your team or reviving them or, you know, like just that. Or hurting undead with skills like holy. Um, there might be a couple others, but it's generally they're there for support. That's why Saren's here is for support. Um, and then black mages are the exact opposite. They blow up everything with copious amounts of magic. Like, in lore, literally pull a meteor out of the sky and throw it into the face of whatever you're fighting. Like, they're insanely fucking strong. Um, so much so that, to reference it again in Final Fantasy XIV, they are illegal uh, to be one without, like, proper clearance or something like that was the the story to it like you you have to be cleared and supervised as a black mage it's wild um they're extremely dangerous uh but yeah he'll be their white and black are both long-term investments but helpful i prefer them more than a red mage just because i prefer the stuff at level 10 for later um but again long-term investments we're gonna be here for a while <laughs> I don't remember how long this game is, but I know it's not short. Uh, I don't want to talk to you because you might take me. Welcome. Let's get a one of these and a one of these. And they're already wearing clothes. Okie dokie. All right, nice. Is a knife? They couldn't even give him a sword. Wacky. Uh. Oh, that's cool. I can't. I can't sell what's already equipped. That's cool. Okay, very, very good. Um. All right. Nunchaku? Really? Okay, pro chances are it's probably going to be better than his hands. It also occurs to me I could have um, done uh, done this a little bit better with um Like, you just equip straight from the shop. And I always forget about that being an option. It's normally that's not an option. Okay. Oh, please, you must rescue the princess. I don't know who that is. Who are you? Why are you back here? Sage Lucon said something about finding the crescent moon. Then he just up and left town. And now you're standing in a dark alleyway behind a building. Sir creepy all right find anything to your liking yeah let's get some yeah yeah okay so yeah this is a big thing as well um <clears throat> there are 10 levels of magic and at each level a character only has three slots for that level I don't know if there's a way to undo it. I don't remember. There might be. Um, but 
That's it. You have three options. So what we're going to do is we're going to do fire. We're going to do sleep. That's it for now. Because I don't know if we, like, find other options or what. I have no idea. Here, absolutely. Yeah, Dia deals damage to all undead enemies. We're probably going to go ahead and do it this way. Okay. And that should be okay. The king truly believes in Lucan's prophecy that the warriors of light will come to save the princess. Well, lucky for you, bud. We are four random travelers that happen to coincidentally be the people you're looking for. Which is also a recurring theme. This is where a lot of RPG, like JRPG tropes started. The king is searching for the prophesied warriors of light. Th those crystals, you must see the king at once. And we get dragged along. Welcome travelers. I'm told you carry crystals. Is this true? Schwing. It's just as Lucan's prophecy foretold. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. Your Majesty, we cannot be certain that these are the words foretold by the prophecy. This guy gets it. We're just four strangers, dude. It's a lot of trust from this kingdom. Yet they stand before us with the crystals. I cannot dismiss this as mere coincidence. Crystal bearers, there is a task I would ask of you. Will you rescue my daughter, Sarah? Can I tell him no? I love when that's an option. Garland, a knight once in his majesty's service, has abducted Princess Sarah. Ask for your aid in the name of his majesty, the King of Cornelia. He doesn't have a name? Garland has taken refuge in the Chaos Shrine, which lies to our north. Of course, we did attempt to save the princess ourselves. But Garland is the finest swordsman in the kingdom. We have none who can match him. Okay. I've heard that you wish to journey to the continent to our north. The bridge leading north was lost long ago, making passage impossible. It's a good thing you guys don't need to fix that or anything. I'm glad you have everything you need in your kingdom. Crazy. You can rescue Sarah. I will have the bridge rebuilt as a token of my gratitude. Go now, warriors of light, and do not fail me. Okay. Let me just absorb all my friends real quick. Okay. <clears throat> we're going to ignore that, though, and we're going to look around for loot. Our reports say that Garland fled north with the princess to the Chaos Shrine. Oh, I thought he was doing, like, a Power Ranger thing. Uh, it doesn't look like... He, like... Hidden items? I don't know if that's a thing. The king is searching for the prophesied warriors of light. Those crystals, could it be? My guy, we're already here. You guys brought us here for this exact conversation. Her majesty's overcome with grief. She shut herself inside her chambers. Please, try not to upset her. What's poppin', lady? I am Jane, Queen of Cornelia. Please, please bring my daughter, my Sarah, back to me safely. Why does she get a name, but the king doesn't? That's weird. Weird to me. What up, lady? You're blocking the hallway. Please, please save Lady Sarah. Yeah, that's the idea. Galen was once the greatest knight in the kingdom, but power consumed him and he lost sight of who he really was. I don't know if that's the word. That's probably not right. We'll get in. We'll get into the what happened with that fella when we get there uh and we will get there oh hello my sister i want my sister okay bye <laughs> guess that's it okay you have more of the same is there no oh my god we can run oh my god we're so fast oh. holy shit we're fast Oh my god, we're so fast. Oh, Jesus. Okay. What up? Our ancestors sealed weapons within this treasure room 400 years ago. They then gave the key to the Elf King to hold until the coming of the Warriors of Light. So wait. Really? Our ancestors sealed... Yep. Really? Okay. That was another thing, is that... Um, 
These games started a maybe not so fun trend of backtracking a lot. Um, I know in some of these games, it's it's a huge issue, honestly. Oh my gosh, she straight bopped him. Dude, what is with this bully and my boy? Poor Boomer, dude. Okay, so Balaam... What the fuck? HP went to 62 in one level? Oh, that's right. This is Final Fantasy. <laughs> I forgot what game I was playing for a second there. Bruh, really? They're doing my boy dirty out here. Everybody got like 20 HP. Boomer got one. What the fuck? That's so mean. Okay. Um, another unfortunate happenstance uh, <clears throat> that I am absolutely going to subject everybody to is grinding. Um, it's not fun. Nobody likes it. But oh, that's weird. When you when you level up, it doesn't raise your health to match. In yeah, that animation used to be a lot slower. They used to like walk into the room and you'd see them all kind of split from you and go to their beds, and then mold back into you afterwards. It was cool. All right. We're going to get a couple levels, and then we'll start making our way out to the... Oh, my God. One wolf, huh? All right. Let's start heading up there. See what we see. I'm pretty sure it's Pokemon rules. We can't be preemptive. Oh, okay. Well... All right. Um, I'm pretty sure we can't be attacked unless we're in the woods. I think it's like Pokemon rules. Oh, we're here. Uh, okay, cool. Gigas worm. What? The Ooh. Lol. Oh my god. Okay, not bad. I got three. What the fuck, dude? They are shafted, my boy. Yeah, everybody's gonna hit triple digits and he's only gonna be at like 30. What the fuck? Okay, something I'm curious on. Is there a way to do, no. Come out. Y'all suck. Lol. Okay. <clears throat> I want to try and run it that this first, um, episode will be getting in and fighting garland because i i remember it being hard but not impossible i think we just need some items if i remember right 
Oh, wait, what? Take a peek at your reflection in the water. Ugh, you're filthy. Use this to wash up. Oh, well, okay. Cool, thanks, game. Uh, let me see. We have no item. Okay, we'll do that. We need two sleeping bags uh, and some potions. And that'll be fine. The I want to see if we can't get one more level. <clears throat> and this is definitely, I think. Kind of a a downside, right, to some of these older games is that a lot of the runtime got padded because you had all this busy work. Even though this isn't really work, right? It's not hard. We're fighting goblins. Um, you know, bitches by any stretch of uh, imagination. But it was still You know, in some cases it was needed. You had games like What, like Castlevania two had a big problem with it. Um some of these old Final Fantasy games, Pokemon, you know, there were a lot of these moments of needing to kind of sit there and um, turn this down just a little bit more. <coughs> um, you know, you had a lot of these moments of needing to just kind of sit back and work on things. About to blow this man up. <clears throat> we tried to run, what a bitch. Got him. Did she flip him off? I really thought for a second the white mage was flipping him off. I was like, yo, that's crazy. Oh my god. 93, 62, 65. Finally. Shit balls, man. Straight up, just doing my man dirty. Wild. But yeah, you know, now it's it's clear even immediately why uh warrior red mage is the go the go-to wombo combo. Because the red mages bring all the support you can need and a lot of very good damaging skills. In addition to um, good melee prowess, you know, they're not the glass cannon that the black mage is. Um, but glass cannons are fun. Okay, I guess we can run into stuff anywhere. We just haven't been. Hmm. Okay. I could have sworn Monk got to hit twice or something. Okay, we'll go in. We'll be okay. Ooh. Not a f oh, God. Not a fan of this. Hey, yo. Nice. How do I... Fuck. Room there. Room up there. There's rooms on each corner and a big one in the middle. I get the feeling I'm going to need to... Check these, but I'm going to do that anyway. Oh, that's my MP. Oh... 
Oh my god. That's right, you get roasted, nerd. Touch me. Toxic. And a leather cap. Uh, okay. Who can wear the leather cap? We're gonna... <laughs> We're gonna give it to Boomer, given his uh, massive, massive lack of defensive stats. Is that the best option? Probably not. Probably not the best idea for him. What? Why didn't that wolf die? Lol. I'll tell you what, he is, uh, he's dodged a pretty solid number of swings, though. Loving that. Okay. Ooh. Oh my god. Uh-oh. That's not good. Okay. Okay. All right, so they wasted their turns. That's what we love to see. Oh, oh, whoops. Please don't. Okay, well. That's probably. Yeah, I'm sure. Ooh, a potion and a tent. Nice. Tent's a little. I mean, it's cool. That's good to have. It's good to have, but. I don't. Oh my god. My god, we are just... I might have over-leveled. 11, 17, 2 intellects, 10 luck. Rufus got some stamina and agility, okay. Theron got some agility, stamina. Boomer got some more health. Let's go. A boy's coming up in the world. We'd love to see it. Oh shit. Uh Uh-oh. Oh. Oh my god. Home girl. You can't be missing. Thank you. Wait, is there a way to do... No, okay. It really looks like she has her middle finger up. That's so funny. <clears throat> nice, nice. Love the hustle. Love the damage coming out of Boomer. Did a whole four. Was it three? Might have been three. Door has been secured with the Mystic Key. You talking about the Mystic Key? The Elven stuff? Why would that be used everywhere? Shit. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, cool, 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 cool. I'm trying to keep up with the chit chat as best I can. I am legitimately worried though. I don't know why. It's not a stressful oh my god. What this guy do? What him doing? Oh, well that's always nice, I guess. Get to one turn something. I am legitimately terrified about. Okay, well, uh, fighting Garland because I don't know. 
that the setup here is going to do very well with it. Um, I don't remember it being difficult because you're you're supposed to do it like immediately. Oh, this fucking. Dumb. Probably wasted, but it's fine. Let's go. What is that? One point. What the fuck? Got shafted. We're going to pop out real quick. Do. Do. Uh, yes, do this. Now, I'm not going to lie to you. If I was doing this alone off camera, I would have walked all the way back to town uh, and done it there. But that does not make for good television. We are not going to do that. Oh god, that's just him. He's just here. Okay, hi. Hello. Hello, beautiful. Your name. Oh, I didn't even get to talk to him. Really? Right here, right before Garland? Fucking really? Fucking really? My man's gonna get one shot. You know what? Actually, I'll take it because that does mean the level up. So I'm okay with that. The king will have no choice but to exchange the kingdom for his daughter's life. Cornelia will be mine. Who's there? Hm. King's lapdogs. Do you have any idea who you're messing with? You really think you have what it takes to cross swords with me? Very well. I, Garland, will knock you all down. Why does he have to give us his name? Like, it's obvious who he is. God, he's so fucking cool, though. Oh my god, he's awesome. I love his design. Ah! Okay, here you go, Boomer. <coughs> Keep my mans from getting one shot. The good thing we did. Oh, why did I just attack? I should have. Mm. Nice. Yeah, he doesn't even. He doesn't really do that much. He just has a lot of health. Okay. Whoosh. Oh, there it was. Let's go. The crit. Yeah, that wasn't nearly as difficult as I thought or remember it being. Maybe you. Hmm. Interesting. We're we just going to leave these bats. Yeah, okay. All right. We'll just leave the bats, I guess. You, you've come to rescue me? I'm Sarah, Princess of Cornelia. Words could never be enough to thank you. It's the first time anyone's ever defeated Garland. You must allow me to show my gratitude. Please, accompany me to Castle Cornelia. No, I want to look at this big orb. What do you mean, yes? Don't speak for me. What's the orb? Damn it. Ah, well. Thank you for returning my daughter to my side. There can be no doubt that you are the warriors of light from Lucan's prophecy. You should hear the prophecy in its entirety. <clears throat> if I may. When darkness veils the world, four warriors of light shall come. If they cannot gather the shards of light, the darkness will consume all. The four crystals will never shine again. Now, I hear that a crystal can be found on the continent to our north. 
Restoring light to the crystals is our only hope of ridding the world of the monsters which plague it. Wait, I, we're holding crystals though. Like this is always this is a thing that even back in the day confused me. We're already holding crystals. It refers to them as crystals, but I think what they are in actuality are shards of the main crystal, which is frustrating because call them shards. I will have the bridge to the north rebuilt as I promised. I pray that you succeed in restoring light to the four crystals and to the world. Oh, that's awkward. Okay, let's talk to everybody. This loot has been entrusted to the princesses of Cornelia for many generations. When he abducted me, Garland took this loot as well. I want you to have it. It may aid you on your journey. We obtain the loot. Cool. I'm sure that's an incredibly important thing that we could have walked out without. The dance in Garland Town. No oh, wait, that's not the right voice. The dance in Garland Town knows many odd bits of information. That's also not the right voice. I don't remember what it was. If you find yourself astray, try talking to her. You may know something that can put you back on course. Okay. Sarah's thoughts are always with you. What about your thoughts, my guy? What the fuck? The Warriors of Light. I can't thank you enough for saving Lady Sarah. Okay, cool. You crushing on her or something, bro? Like, why don't you just tell her? Yep. Same deal. Nobody over there. Uh, let's talk to Le Mom and the sister. I don't know how I could ever thank you for rescuing Sarah. Okay, cool. Good talk. Okay. And then we'll run across to... My sister's back, and it's uh, thanks to you all. I could just kiss you, ma'am. What? Uh, ma'am? Okay. Fair enough. You know what? Fair enough. She's a kid. She's excited. I get it. Wait, what the? Oh. I was very confused for a second. Orders from His Majesty. We're to do our part to fulfill Lucan's prophecy. These guys work fast. Oh my god, these guys work fast. They're not, uh... Okay, there they go. I don't really... Let's go. What does this bridge have to do with the prophecy? The four warriors of light are here. They're here in Cornelia. How does nobody talk to each other? Like, how do you miss that? Cornelia, the city of dreams. Okay. Hi there, I'm a dancer. What's that? You want to dance with me? <laughs> so, why are you still here? Weren't you supposed to be crossing that bridge to the north? You must really want to dance with me. Okay. No. First off, which name Matoya lives to the north of Cornelia? Oh. You're needing a ship if you want to be able to move about more freely. If you have trouble obtaining one through normal means, you can always borrow a pirate ship. Yeah, true. They say Matoya's peepers aren't too sharp. She can't see a thing without a crystal eye. I'm sure that'll be relevant information later. Okie doke. How much more money we got? You're okay, welcome. Oh my god, like so much. Go ahead and do this. Uh, grab a couple of these. And let's go see. I don't think they will. I probably just blew all my money for no reason. But I want to see. Do you have new things in stock? No, you don't. Okay. What about... You have new things in stock? No, you don't. Okie dokie. No. Okay. 
All right. So, just are you fuck really, bruh? Oh my god, twice, twice. Okay. So that is where we will cut this one. <clears throat> That's where we'll cut this one. Um, like I said, this is going to be the first of many. Um, they're going to all be kept around this kind of time frame. Um, anywhere from 30 minutes to an hour. Um, first of many, I'm going to be recording these in chunks. So the next few episodes will be from this same day. Um, same issues, same awkwardness, same scuffness, all that. Uh, and then they'll be going out over time once the net's back, which hopefully will be later today. But we will see on that. Um, you know, for the most part, though, I think, I mean, really, there's not a lot else to it. It's just, it's the streams, but pre-recorded. Um, <laughs> so. Well. <laughs> I had to catch a nap before I record the next one. I don't know yet. Hmm. Okay. <coughs> um, that's going to do it for now. Bar is going to go on temporary break. We will see you when it opens back up next time. That's stupid. That's a stupid outro. That's a dumb outro. Anyway, that's it. Uh, you know, as with, you know, as I say with the streams all the time, let me know feedback, negative or positive. Um, just let me know all of it, your thoughts on it, games you want to see. Um, scream at me because I'm not using the min max and comp, absolutely backseat, whatever you want to do. Ask me random things about what I ate today, like I don't care. Um, <clears throat> as far as keeping up with things, though, like I mentioned at the beginning, I think that may have been when I was testing. Um, you know. I normally what I do is I stream here on YouTube. Um, you're already here on the channel, so you know where to find them. Um, I will have it linked and everything, but my Twitter as well at sushi fish. Um, you are, I think it's at sushi fish. Uh, that's where all stream updates and you know any kind of. Oh my god, dude. Oh, I'm getting attacked by yawns here out of nowhere. Um, that's where any sort of updates or uh, shit posting or questions or conversations or memes or anything will be shared. That is the main source to catch me on. Um, so definitely follow there for updates. Uh, uh, you know past that same as i said you know feedback let me know what you guys think hope you guys enjoyed it there will be many 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 more um for the first bits it'll probably be focused around these rpgs you know these longer games where we can sit and relax and i can just sort of talk to you guys and and tell some stories and things like that while we mindlessly grind our face into the dirt um and you know we'll see how it goes from there but i don't know for for now though that's it uh so hopefully you guys enjoyed it and we'll do this again very soon but bye bye for now